there. Good morning. It's Sandy Freshy, human design specialist, intuitive coach, and consultant on human design and self-care. And this is just a quick recording to share something with you. It's uh, Tuesday, May 23rd, 2017. As you can see on this uh, human design uh, transit, body graph transit chart, it, uh, this chart was taken at uh, 939 with my human design app. Uh, that you could get at humandesignapp.com for your phone, just so you know the reference of where the chart came from. But this is not really about where to get the app. It's actually about um, what's going on in the transits. Over in my Joyful Vibrant Life self-care circle on Facebook, uh, a bunch of the people in the group, the group members, have expressed that they're feeling really exhausted. So you guys, if you're watching this, I want to show you um, why that could be happening at this point. And we all know uh, in our bodies and intuitively, especially in uh, the Northern Hemisphere here, this time of year, the end of May, coming into the beginning of June and sliding into preparing for summer, that things can get kind of hectic and it's easy to feel frazzled. So I want to show you uh, where what's happening in the transits that could be contributing to that or um, uh, influencing that feeling of I've got to get it done I've got to do it fast it's got to happen right now um, and I'm so exhausted I'm staying up later I feel like I'm driven to do more it, and I'm, I feel like I'm too busy so if you look at uh, the sacral center which is the uh, red square, uh, the red center that's second from the bottom on the body graph, that is the center for generative, regenerative workforce and life force energy. And right now in the transits, in the way that uh, the, the gates and the planets are lining up in uh, the cosmos, we've got the 34, the gate 34 and the gate 20, which take this sacral regenerative, uh, gotta work, gotta, gotta use that motor type of energy right up to the throat for expression and manifestation. If you innately have this channel, the 34 and the 20 going from the sacral to the throat center, if that's actually part of your chart, you are known as a pure manifesting generator. So you operate off of this energy all the time. For those of us who don't have that, who are not pure manifesting generators, and especially for those of you who, who don't have the sacral center defined where in your chart it's white instead of colored in, then when this transit comes in of being really busy, of feeling, having the energy to, uh, to manifest at a very quick rate, to do things and be busy and get things done at a very quick rate, it can actually wear you out. So I want to just bring this up because we have a few more days where the 3420 is going to be in, uh, influencing us in the transits. I think it goes out after the 26th of May. Um, and for those of you who don't have this regenerative energy in of the sacral center, you could be feeling very tired and exhausted just because you're bringing so much of this busy energy into your body that your, your body's not designed to use and metabolize on the, a long-term basis. So please be very gentle with yourself. If you're feeling extra energized when you don't normally feel that way, uh, work with that energy very wisely. If you have a, a body type and a design where you need to go to bed before you're tired, make sure that you still adhere to taking care of your body in that way. And those of you who have sacral energy already, um, but maybe not the 3420 in your chart, um, you, you also may be feeling very tired and feeling like you need to work extra hard to run that energy out. So, but honor your body, um, take very good care of your physical body and know that if you're feeling exhausted, there are some other transits that are gonna come in um, in June that are gonna be, that are gonna make it so that you're feeling, you may feel a little chaotic and, uh, and we may talk about those when they come in if it's really affecting you. But this one is a biggie, especially for uh, people who are very 
open and intuitive or have a lot of these centers open, especially the sacral center. So I wanted to bring this out for you. If you don't know uh, whether or not you have this energy in your uh, human design chart, whether you're designed with this energy already, the 3420, um, or if you want to get a good look at your body graph to see whether or not you have the sacral energy defined or not, you can go to my website at sandyfreshy, F-R-E-S-C-H-I dot com and um, sign up for the uh, Harmonious Work and Life human design kit and I will be happy to send you a chart and you will also get my newsletter, my updates and a whole bunch of really informative videos about human design to get you started on your journey of understanding yourself through this lens. If you uh, don't want to get a chart from me, that's perfectly fine. Uh, there are plenty of other places online where you can get a free human design chart and you can Google that. But I do hope you come back for more. Um, I'd love to share more about uh, what's going on with human design and how that relates to you, what's going on with the transits. I find that very fascinating. And when it's pertinent, I will continue to share that. So again, if you want a chart and uh, to, to stay in touch with me, please go to sandyfreshy.com and sign up for the Harmonious Work and Life Human Design Kit. If you have any questions, please post them on this page and I will do my best to answer and respond. Have a wonderful week and we will talk again soon.